Thank you. We have an update now on ice-covered streets that are nearly impassable in some areas. Well, they're finally getting the attention they need. Some neighbors in Redford Township have it really bad. 7 Action News reporter Malcolm Maddox has new information now on their troubles. Just when you think you've got it bad, someone else has got it so much worse. Take a look at this uh, ice rink here in Redford Township. This is how many of the roads look. You can barely stand on them, let alone drive on them. And neighbors say the worst part of all this is it's been like this for most of the winter. I got stuck several times. And it's not hard to see why. It's almost as though the roads have been repaved with ice. Attempting to drive down these streets is like an off road adventure if you're lucky enough to actually get your wheels to turn. I had to call AAA to come out and pull me from my spot. Virginia Vaughn is fed up and she wants the situation fixed now. We pay taxes, they get their money, do your job. We do our end, you do your job. That job belongs to Wayne County, but unfortunately, residential streets are not as high a priority with all the snow and ice and the bumper crop of potholes that are continuously popping up. It's taking crews a little longer to get to everyone, but the Wayne County Road Commission wants everyone in Redford to know you have not been forgotten. Salt trucks were crisscrossing the area around Tecumseh and Nathaline as our cameras rolled, and more work is scheduled to be complete, but it won't be completed overnight. In the meantime, Virginia Vaughn has a message for Wayne County. I know prevention would have been the key. Prior to getting like this, they should have came out here. You just made your work harder. So um, how you fix it is on your end. I just want to fix. In Redford Township, Malcolm Maddox, 7 Action News.